friends, how are you today? It's Miss Heather, and it's a gorgeous day outside. It's Friday, May 1st. It's the very first day of a brand new month. I hope you're all doing well. I have a favorite story by one of my absolute favorite authors and illustrators. Hang on one sec. His name is Mo Willems. And he wrote so many great stories and illustrated them too, which means he wrote the words and he drew the pictures. Um, so he wrote all the elephant, elephant and piggy stories. He has written all of the pigeon stories. This guy is pretty funny. He gets into a lot of trouble. He also wrote Nuffle Bunny stories. I don't know if you've seen any of these, but he is a fun author. Here's another elephant and piggy story. It's very funny. I really like slap. Um, so Mo is funny. So you know you're gonna giggle every time that you read one of his stories, okay? Do you remember what we did before we read our last story? We're gonna take one deep breath. Really, we wanna take three, but we'll stick to one today, okay? So if you can, kind of feel where your ribs are, okay? And put your hands on your bony ribs. I know it's hard for you to see on the screen, but my hands are, are not on my hips, they're up on my ribs. And I'm gonna feel my lungs fill up with air. I'm gonna breathe in through my nose and out through my mouth to help our bodies get ready to listen, to be calm, okay? Are you ready? Here we go, we'll just do one. Here we go. One big deep breath will help calm your heart, your body, and your mind, and you're ready to listen to the story. So I thought I'd pick a funny one. All right. Um, and this one is called, I Love My New Toy. Did you ever get a toy that you just loved? Oh, you're so excited to get it. Maybe it was for a special occasion a friend gave it to you, or it's a fun one at school that you just love to play with. Well, that is how Piggy is feeling. Look at, look at her face. Oh, she's so happy. In fact, she has a tear, but it's not a sad tear. It's like a happy tear. All right, let's check it out. Elephant is wondering, hmm, what, wow, Piggy's awfully excited. The thing to know about these two is they are really good friends, and they're very different super different, but together they make a great friendship, a great team. Okay, so let's check it out and see what they're like. I love my new toy. Hi, Piggy. What are you doing? Did you notice all the expressions on their faces? They show lots of feelings throughout the book. Look at my new toy. I love my new toy. Do you see how big those letters are? That means she's saying it loudly or with lots of expression and excitement. Well, what does it do? I have no idea. Hmm. Maybe it is a throwing toy. I love throwing toys. Here, try it. Yes. Look, even his eyes turn red. He's like, ooh. He's trying really hard. Zip. Can you pretend to throw something up? Zip. I'm watching it come down. Nice throw. Thanks. Oh, boy. Here it comes. Zoom. Whew. That was a big throw. Break. Oh, gosh. How do you think Pinky's going to feel? How do you think Elephant is going to feel? I'm a little nervous. Uh-oh. Surprised. 
broke your toy. Broke my toy. My new toy. I am mad. You can tell the expression on her face. And sad. I am mad and sad. Because you can have lots of feelings at the same time. Yes. Oh boy, this means. <sighs> You are sorry? Very sorry. Oh. I wonder if Pinky will forgive him. I do not care. My new toy is broken. <gasps> she doesn't want to forgive. And you broke it. Have a break and snap toy. Snap. That is a fun toy. Oh, it looks a little perplexed, a little confused. Enjoy. Hmm. What will happen next with these two friends? Break. Snap. Hmm. Look at those cheeks. Break, snap, hmm. Now look at Elephant. Do you remember when Piggy would not forgive Elephant? Hmm. It probably didn't feel very good. Do you want to play with my new toy? No, hmm. no. You do not want to play with my new toy? I do not want to play with your new toy. She realized she made a mistake. I want to play with you. Friends are more fun than toys. Aw. You're it. No, you are. The end. And at the end of every elephant and piggy book, Pigeon is hiding. Can you find Pigeon? Can you find her? right there. Awesome. So have you ever had a time where you and a friend maybe had an argument? Were you able to say you were sorry? Were you able to forgive? Were you able to handle those feelings and make really good choices? And if you want in the moment, it's never really too late to say you're sorry. All right, friends, I hope you enjoyed Mo Willem's story with Elephant and Piggy. I'll have to read another one of those because I just love them. I hope you have a good day and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.